This is an instructional on how to decant Wegovy 2.4 milligram semaglutide from an auto injector pen to a 5 milliliter vial. The supplies required will be a Wegovy 2.4 milligram semaglutide auto injecting pen along with a 5 milliliter vial. To begin, first we will need to remove the plastic cap from the 5 milliliter vial and that will reveal the self-healing in self injection port. So this is the most critical part which is the actual injection itself. Um, what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to line this up, the needles on the in the center of the pen here. So what you're going to want to do is line this up with the center as best as possible and then you're going to just push down on the injecting pen hold it down until you hear the second click and now you've just injected the prescription into the 5 milliliter bottle To draw up the medicine, you'll either want to use a TB syringe or an insulin syringe. I'll be taking a 0.5 milligram dose, so I will need to draw up a total of 0.15 milliliter of the semaglutide 2.4. To draw up the semaglutide from the 5 milliliter vial, you'll first want to remove the cap from the TB syringe. You'll first want to draw a little bit so that way we can put a little bit of pressure on the inside. And we're going to poke this through the self-healing injection port, like so. And then you're going to want to turn the whole thing upside down. And you're going to want to just press on the plunger. And then we're going to draw up 0.15 milliliter. of semaglutide. Go just a tad past. And bring it to 0.15. And there it is. And I'll put the cap back on for safety. Set this to the side. And you'll want to put the 5 milliliter vial back into the refrigerator. I like to wrap up the 5 milliliter vial in aluminum foil so that we can keep it away from other items in the refrigerator. I'll just roll that up. Push that down. And push this side down. And now this is nice and sanitary for the refrigerator. So to inject the dose, I'm gonna use an alcohol prep pad and rub that on the injection area. So I'll pull this out. Make sure you wash your hands first before you uh, do an injection. You wanna to try to be as sanitary as possible. So you wanna be anywhere more than one inch around your, your belly button. And I'll, I'll probably put it right, right about in here. So I'll, I'll kind of pinch the area a little bit. Clean the area up really, really good. I usually like to go for a minimum of just, you know, 10 seconds to make sure I have the area nice, nice and sanitary. Then I'm going to take the, the syringe. I'm going to pull the cap from the syringe. And this is already uh, loaded, so I'm going to go ahead and kind of pinch the area. And I'm 
go ahead and do the injection and press the plunger and pull it. That's all there is to it. I didn't even feel it.